interesting proposition. Student athlete, wide receiver for number 319. Spread pine straw in his free time. If he ever gets over to Charlotte, he needs some work desperately at the moment. Or throws it out there. It was caught by Jack Jansen. Sophomore from Catholic High School here in Knoxville. As you see now, we'll have you for a few minutes, it looks like, before Vandy and Mizzou starts at the top of the hour. Thanks again to all those fine folks, Stitch, that yeah. set us up for you and for Alyssa this week. We love coming to Knoxville. Yeah, no doubt. Jeff, Charlie. Chris, Grant, Steven, all those guys, Carter, came in handy. And our girl, Brianna, Thank who was on the boat with me yesterday, with the drone camera. I know she's at the front house of Houston. She did a great job with that. Oh, no. Patrick Wilk, Barnes. And that should do it. Let Tennessee run one more play. And they're going to let Gaston Moore throw it to the end zone. And it's intercepted on the last play of the game as Ty Woods gets the interception. And Tennessee wins the game 65 to 24. Tennessee wins on homecoming, still undefeated. Tennessee wins it 65-24. Tennessee 7-0 next week. It's SEC after dark. Tennessee Volunteers host Kentucky next week in prime time and SEC after dark. See you guys next week in Knoxville. talked about, Josh Eichel said, good teams get better. They certainly regain their focus after a somewhat slow start, especially defensively, before they pile up points again. Melissa Smith, Coach. Coach, you talked about the intensity of your team throughout practice this week after that big win. What do you make of their performance today? I thought the performance with our, our ones on both sides of the ball, especially James Blue Silo today. I didn't like some of the stuff that I saw in the second half from some of our young guys. Uh, opportunity for them to improve. They got to learn from it. We got to get better as we uh, go back out the season. How meaningful is it to get some of those young guys in for meaningful game reps today? Yeah, great reps, great opportunities for them to learn and understand the urgency that you have to have in your preparation. Uh, seeing a guy in front of you make plays doesn't mean you're going to go make those same plays. Thanks, Coach. Congrats. Appreciate it. Tennessee is 7-0. Skyhawks fall to 4-3. Matt Stitchko and Alyssa Lang, Adam Coppinger, and our entire production team. I'm Taylor Zarzer. In Knoxville, Tennessee, beats UT Martin 65-24. Back to the studio and our guy, Peter Burns.